Rugby at Romy's headquarters and we're in front of the D800. It's the latest machine, so what's new? Yeah, well this, this D800 machine, vertical machine in centre, uh, AMB last year in September, uh, it had a new look, a new a facelift essentially. You've got here a new livery, but in addition to that, if you'd known the Romy range for the last few years, because we've been doing a lot of work with them, mm -hmm. you'll see they've been very successful selling their vertical machine in centres. This particular D800 is probably their best selling machine, um, but now now it's, it's heavier than the previous D800, so it's about 20% more in weight, a bigger casting. Also now runs on uh, roller guide ways as opposed to, to linear. Um, it's a fast machine, it's actually faster than it than it previously was. It's got um, exclusivity on the FANUC control here, the OI FANUC control. Uh, at the moment, exclusivity on the HMI option of this control. So it's a very powerful control. Uh, the machine itself, well, you've also got a bigger Y axis. You've got 600 in the Y, whereas the, the predecessor to this model had 560, and we know how much engineers like to have that mm -hmm. extra Y axis. So with the D800, you've kind of got 800 in the X, 600 in the Y, you've almost got that cube effect. Mm -hmm. The great thing is with roaming machines, and I, I know you've probably got another question you want to ask me, um, they come with through spindle coolant, they come with a 30 station tool changer, they come with a chip conveyors, they come with all of those options as standard at a very good price. Yeah, and very successful as you say. To be honest, Paul, all I was going to ask you is, you know, what's its USP? But I think you've covered all of that. Well, it, yeah, <laughs> it, is, it, it is a fast machine and Romy are becoming increasingly popular here in the UK and around the world. Um, I know as uh, speaking with Gio about these machines earlier, they're obviously an OEM, they make their own machines in yeah. Brazil. They're, you know, when, when you look at them, their own foundry, when you look at them as a global organisation, they've really only scratched the surface here in the UK. Now, this is the 800, but they have the 1000, they have the 1250 verticals as well. Uh, and I know that the five axis is soon to be coming with a new livery as well. Um, but it's not just machines, milling machines. They do turning centres, they do oil country lathes, they do semi CNC flatbed lathes, five axes, as I mentioned, and we can't forget injection moulding.